Hello everyone, we just received a box from White2T for the Tea of the Month Club for February. So, thought we'd do a little unboxing video. Wow. You know, I used to work at Target. Maybe you should let oh. me do that. I'm really good at box cutting. I used to work in a warehouse and they gave me a box cutter. And then after a week, they took away the box cutter and told me to go to the front office and work there from now on. So, I think I know what I'm doing. <laughs> okay. What's we in have there? Bubble wrap. I thought this was. <laughs> hold up, hold up. I thought this was white 2T. It's not. Oh, what is it? It's my tea pal. Oh, wow. Double surprise. Let's see what we got. We have wild purple. purple how do you say that? Ya bao? Ya bao. Ya bao. It's all white tea. Wild purple. Ya bao. Wu Liangshan white tea. An organic white tea cake. How do you say that? Fo Zhong. Fo Zhong. Nan Li Gu Shu. Gu Shu white tea. Huh? Did you know this was all going to be white tea? Well, I knew that the My Tea Pal Club was going to be white tea. Because oh, I don't really like white tea. Oh, well, you can leave the video. Okay. <laughs> it comes out stay, stay. Well, I want to drink the wild purple because purple is my mm -hmm. favorite color. Interesting to me. What is this? Is that one? Yeah. Okay. Oh, wow. Interesting. Very interesting. Wow. Just visually, such a cool looking mm -hmm. tea. Oh, and then you can see the little purple in there. These are beautiful. Mm -hmm. These don't even look like tea leaves. I feel like this is like art. Mm -hmm. So cool. Okay, well, let's brew it up. Yeah. Let's rinse these off. This smells like a combination of fall leaves, rose, and asparagus. Nope, that's not it. Artichoke? Nope, that's not it. Maybe your tea helper could help. Ah, uh, tea helper. What does my mm. tea smell like? I'm picturing myself in like a old train depot. Old people wearing old clothes. Yeah. Like it's probably circa 1880. Wildflower yeah. smell is wafting mm -hmm. into the home, the uh, the train depot because the doors open. <laughs> that just looks like water. That looks like <laughs> pure water. That was over a minute of steeping that. Wow. There's you think a little there's stuff. Is there going to be any there. flavor in that? I have no idea. There is some stuff in there. <laughs> like a zucchini. Mmm. Like a, yeah. after you just peeled it. Were you ready to see what our pale zucchini water tastes like? That has a very heavy squash taste to it. Very fall, mm -hmm. squash heavy. If you made a sweet potato chili with some cinnamon in it, and some clover. Clover! Yeah, more clover. Not That's cinnamon. it. Clover. This tastes much closer to a tisane than a tea. Yeah, this is not like when you think of white tea or if you've drinking white tea, it's no. not that flavor profile at all. All right, let's see if that brings out a little more flavor here. That's what the leaves look like now. Mm -hmm. Little claws, like little armadillo, like paws. More like a rat. This is a rat claw. That's disgusting. Get out of here. <laughs> Still looks like water. Rat claw water. <laughs> Pretty similar to the first. Yeah. Teeny tiny bit more flavor, but not much. It is a little more floral, I would say, on this steep. This grassy wildflower. So it's not like floral, like in your face, like a rose or a lavender. No. It's just this really subtle. Same. Yep. Exact so, same. <laughs> uh, I have nothing more to say about this tea. That's it. Sum it up for us, Bethany. One hit wonder squash tea looks more interesting than it tastes. If you're into herbals, 
but want caffeine. <laughs> it was a it was a cool experience of something different. Yeah. Um, having a flavor I never had before. So there's the wild purple tea from the My Tea Pal Tea of the Month Club featuring Yunnan white teas. Enjoy your tea journey. Bye everyone. I like that ending where I spit it. Do you think that was good? I think you're going to regret it when you're editing. <laughs> I think I'm going to regret this whole video when I'm editing it. <laughs>